Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. I'm recovered and alhamdulillah there will be no a series of videos coming again and we will continue the series of PLC training and last week thanks to Usman who is our instructor IT and Automation Academy he delivered the session on PLC and HMI communication but we will continue that for today the plan is to have a automation tech show that we are going to discuss in today's automation tech show is smart city concepts and industrial IoT. So I have one expert from that particular domain who is going to be in today's automation tech show. So I'm going to take you guys to that particular show. My name is Boris Kaminski. I'm coming from company Alpha AP. I am business development manager of the company. Uh, we are doing a smart home system smart building system, hospitality solutions, but also today hot topic are smart cities. Uh, what we are exactly doing, we are developing products, we are producing products by software and hardware. Today's smart city, as I tell, big topic, three main protocols in the world, Sigfox, Narrowband and LoRa. These three protocols are main in our world used as a IoT protocols and LQIP is doing uh, devices and solutions for these networks. Uh, this network are used depend on the country which is covered. Uh, what about it is? It is about uh, street light control, parking sensors, flood detections, uh, also garage control, smart street cameras, and so on. A little bit here, I will explain you what about it is. Let's have an example. Uh, we have a street light, which is standardly LED street light connected on the pillar. The solution is. We put their uh, IoT device, which is this one on Kema socket, which is standardly on the street light. After the device is wirelessly uh, communicating with the BTS station, which can be on the tower of the mobile operator. Uh, the distance between them could be up to 50 kilometers. The real one is approximately 71. After the BTS station is connected to the internet, and we are able to see as a maintenance of the city on the dashboard uh, what is the consumption of the light. We can turn off, we can turn on, we can uh, select a brightness, for example, when there's uh, no traffic jam uh, outside, like uh, from 2 p.m. until, for example, 5 p.m. or morning, 2 a.m. until 5 a.m. Uh, these solutions we have uh, not only for a street light, but as I mentioned also for uh, parking sensors. This is the sensor which is you just uh, put to the ground and he is measuring the on magnetic field if there is an incoming car. Uh, lifetime of the battery is approximately uh, 10 years. After we have solution for uh, energy monitoring, so you have an uh, existing meter where the close to the meter is connected to this device and to the meter via LED sensor we are counting the flashing of the pulses and after it transmits to the battery station and after we are seeing it on the dashboard of the city. In this way we are able to following up uh, the energy consumption of the flats, apartments and also buildings. After we have on this uh, kind of protocols the uh, air quality sensors, also flood detectors and motion detectors. Next division what we have in the company is the hospitality solution or uh, is hospitality solution which is focused on a guest room management system for new hotels but also for retrofits. This is a central unit which is able to cover uh, up to 576 units uh, but the whole system is able to cover eight these central units with eight times 576 which is more than 4,000. These are the controllers, customers can use uh, custom, custom software, uh, this is a fan coil controller, this is a card reader, this is a bedside panel, customers are able to select also the icons uh, for printing because what is the pro biggest problem if you come to hotel, you don't know what, which switch you should touch to uh, turn on this light, so therefore we are making custom printing also. The installation in case of wireless solution is approximately 25 minutes. Uh, it is done by uh, really retrofits. Such uh, uh, nice references what we have in the Emirates are uh, Hotel Movenpick in Dubai Laguna, Rafals, Maidan, and next are coming and coming. Next division what we have in a company, let's invite you, are uh, smart buildings. 
we are doing also building solution. It is same principle like we have a main controller and peripheral units. But the difference is that we are compatible with also Niagara uh, software, which we after connect all the technologies from the hotel, from the building, under one platform. Last thing what I will introduce you are relays, because Elko EP company is uh, one of the biggest producer of modular electronic devices in Europe. Uh, we are doing approximately 250 types of relays, like dimmers, monitoring voltage, monitoring current, level switches, thermostats, power supplies, and so on. So thank you very much for explaining. And Pleasure. And hopefully we will have amazing content to explain our audience about IoT and the smart city concept. Thank you. So see you soon, inshallah, again. You are coming again, let me know. Thank you very much. Play your video. That's all about Automation Tax Show. I have another very exciting news in today's video. That is actually I have started a channel for my daily vlogs. I'm uploading almost regularly there, but definitely it's just a start. I have to upload regularly there. I haven't tell you guys, but you are actually my family here on ITN Automation Academy. It's injustice to not actually share everything with you guys. So if you guys are interested to watch that, I'm just gonna drop the link of that particular channel in the description of that video. So if you guys are interested to know about my daily stuffs, so that particular link is gonna be very much helpful for you guys. I hope you liked today's tech show. Be sure to hit the like button. And if you haven't subscribed yet, ITN Automation Academy's YouTube channel. Guys, what are you are waiting for, man? We are already getting up to the level of 22 lectures. And most probably on this weekend, we have 23rd lecture on PLC coming up. And we have posted already SCADA almost whole training series. And DCS training, we have posted five lectures. And in industrial networks, in interview questions, we are posting regularly. So this is a very, very good chance for you if you are interested to learn automation. Don't waste it, buddies. Chaltam.